So if you want to change the world, start off by making your bed. If you make your bed every morning, you will have accomplished the first task of the day. It will give you a small sense of pride, and it will encourage you to do another task, and another, and another. And by the end of the day, that one task completed will have turned into many tasks completed. Making your bed will also reinforce the fact that the little things in life matter. If you can't do the little things right, you'll never be able to do the big things right. And if by chance you have a miserable day, you will come home to a bed that is made, that you made. And a made bed gives you encouragement that tomorrow will be better. Start each day with a task completed. Find someone to help you through life. Respect everyone. Know that life is not fair and that you will fail often. But if you take some risks, step up when the times are the toughest, face down the bullies, lift up the downtrodden, and never, ever give up, if you do these things, the next generation and the generations that follow will live in a world far better than the one we have today. And what started here will indeed have changed the world for the better. So my dad was a uh, lieutenant colonel in the United States Army. He was in the Army for 21 years. And uh, this was mandatory every morning. So thanks, Dad. What's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are having a blessed day. And if you're new here, thank you for clicking on that button and checking this video out. So by way of YouTube analytics, I've come to find that I only hold you guys' attention for about three minutes. So the intro to this video is going to be super simple and super fast. Sunday. Church. Fried chicken. West Coast Swing. Tonight I'm going down to Paragon Dance Center in Tempe, Arizona for a West Coast swing event put on by my friend Faye. That girl is Faye is an amazing dancer and she is putting on an event called Momentos. Let's go check it out.
What's up guys, I'm here with my friend, uh, special friend, and introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Faye. <laughs> this is Faye. In some your face is the best thing in the world. She uh, put on the event tonight. Uh, Faye, kind of explain the event tonight and, and why you uh, did this. I started this event tonight because I just don't feel like there's enough uh, West Coast within our community that's oriented towards, you know, people our age. I feel like we were lacking in something for us. I also felt like we were lacking events that had good advertising, like we weren't reaching enough places. I wanted to really start bringing in the West Coast community and start helping it grow. Kind of explain like the the concept of the uh, ambassadors and I saw those uh, neon bracelets and, and what was up with that? I stole an idea from Michigan Classic where they had the all-stars come out and dance with all the new people or pretty much everybody in general but nobody could ask the all-stars to dance during that time. Mm -hmm. This kept the all-stars from feeling pressured, gave them time to take breaks when they needed to. So I, I used that same idea here so that we could really welcome in um, the newcomers and make everybody feel more welcome and we could reach out to them. So I use these these bracelets, these glow bracelets, so cool. as a chance to, uh, so everybody can see who we are. Very cool. And your ambassadors tonight, what levels did they range from? You know, I had people from all levels. I had novice, intermediate, advanced, all-star. I literally had every, uh, every type of da dancer as an ambassador out there. I chose people based off of their personalities and people who I think are particularly friendly within our community already. And then any words of advice to people either thinking of starting West Coast, or maybe they're new to West Coast, anything that you could pass on to them? Really have to just get out there and dance. I mean, it's scary and it's intimidating, oh, yeah. but Especially it's- Especially when you dance with her. <laughs> it's a lot of fun and nobody's gonna remember that you were, I mean, everybody <laughs> started bad. Nobody starts oh, yeah. out good, everybody starts out bad. They're not gonna be like, haha, I remember that one time you were off time? <laughs> that doesn't happen. So you just gotta get out there. You have to keep actively pursuing it. Like if you're not dancing, twice a week, it's going to be really hard to progress. This gal here is one of my biggest influence in this dance. Great advice from her. Just keep dancing. So everyone out there in YouTube land, <laughs> just keep dancing. So basically, I just want to get everybody out of here dancing and having a good time. All right, let's dance. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire but it's no use cause you can't stop it from shining through it's true baby let the light shine through if you believe it's true baby won't you let the light shine through for you In the sky, gazing far 
into the night I raise my hand to the fire But it's no use Cause you can't stop it from shining through It's true Baby, let the light shine through If you believe it's true Baby, won't you let the light 